chosen to talk on probability and its applications because I believe even without a formal study, we live our lives guided by an instinctive understanding of it. However, only a rigorous study of it can help us avoid pitfalls like the gambler's fallacy and protect us from cognitive errors that spring from unconscious biases and an unchecked intuition. The famous Monty Hall problem in probability illustrates how often our common sense and intuition can mislead us. During World War II, Abraham Wald was given the task of armoring planes. On the planes that returned, most of the damage was located on the fuselage and very little around motors. While the military was keen to add armor around the fuselage, Walt suggested something totally counterintuitive. One wasn't seeing enough planes with damage around motors because most of these did not return. If each point on the plane had an equal probability of being hit, he inferred that the motors were the weakest point that needed extra armor. Consider a test for cancer with 98% accuracy. Assume a population where 0.5% actually have cancer. Now imagine, one has taken the test and has informed somebody that he has tested positive. How depressed should he be? Probability gives us a surprising answer. Be cautiously optimistic. Application of conditional probability and Bayes' theorem assures us that the probability of actually having cancer given that one has tested positive is only 20%. Just a few centuries back, while gambling was popular, no one attempted to understand randomness, which was seen as an expression of the divine will. Now, we see the rise of actuarial science that applies mathematical methods to assess risk in health, insurance and finance. Probability can be a lot of fun and rewarding too. It can help you get better at gambling and win at Monopoly. And while there are two approaches to love, through the head and through the heart, and neither seems to work very well, there's a better chance of success if both are used. And probability can help with this little secret. Reject 37% of the number of suitors you expect to encounter and then accept the first heartthrob. Thank you.